We are going to talk about the 15 ways to use ChatGPT for marketing. You can find it here at chat.openai.com. The first one is create a marketing plan. So within seconds, it's already writing. You can ask it to write a press release for your collection or anything you want, any kind of product you want. You can ask it to find the publications and websites and blogs and whatever that you want to put this press release out to to promote your collection. You can ask it to generate ideas for posts on Twitter, on Instagram, on LinkedIn, whatever it is that you wanna ask it to do. You can ask it to actually write your social media posts for Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, whatever you can think of. Popular hashtags. This is sorta of huge because even though you can go and you can find this information yourself, it's really cool to ask ChatGPT to list however many popular hashtags, I said 30 because that's the maximum on Instagram, that you would wanna use and then you know, of course you'd want to hashtag the name of your collection, but it's really interesting to see what it comes up with. Number seven, explain how to contact publications. You may not even know how to do a press release. You may never even have heard of a press release for your product or your business or whatever. And for an NFT collection, who do you contact? Because that is very specific. Number eight, write a cover letter requesting a story or an interview. You want to put out your press release, and then you wanna think about asking the same publications, hey, interested in doing a story, or maybe you wanna interview us? And then you can literally ask ChatGP to write those interview questions for you. You could even pre-send your interview to the publication so they don't even have to do anything. They could literally just post it. Sometimes editors love that. Number 10, explain how to create a chatbot. It's something that will go on your social media or your website and respond for you and respond in place of you. Get number 11, you can ask to list popular chatbot building platforms and links. If you've never even heard of a chatbot, you wouldn't even know where to begin any of this kind of research, would you? Let ChatGPT do the research for you. That's what that's all about. Number 12, list examples of keywords and phrases that your chatbot can respond to. Now you have to be sure to enter information about your project so that it understands what your project is about so it knows the keywords that you probably should be asking. Number 13, please explain chatbot how to use botkit with node.js. This might sound like gobbledygook to you, but this is all based on what chatbot has previously come up with. Number 14, what are the elements that you need for a media kit? What would you put into a media kit that you would be sending out? Anyone that's interested in perhaps interviewing you or posting information about your collection would want. Where do you post? What do you put into it? That's another thing that you want to know. And number 15, write a bio example. Why is that so important? Well, sometimes it's really hard to write your own bios. If you give all of the details to ChatGPT and say, write the bio for me, it's going to come up with something maybe you didn't think of coming up with yourself or maybe the way it, it presents it is going to be different from how you were thinking of presenting it. ChatGPT is an incredible artificially intelligent chat bot that responds to you no matter what you query, no matter what prompts you give it with information that you may or may not know, may or may not have thought of yourself, but absolutely it will give you some really amazing feedback on whatever it is you ask it. Now's the time to try it. That is today's interesting video about how to use ChatGPT, an incredible artificial intelligent chatbot that can give you answers on virtually anything. It's quite extraordinary. But the extent of it, it just doesn't give you an answer like on Google, it'll just be like one line. Right. This gives you a whole list of everything. It's extraordinary what you can actually, the information that you can get. And again, it, some of it may not be correct. So you have to make sure that you do your own research. But wow, I mean, if this is the kind of thing that you're interested in using, check it out because it is quite extraordinary.